Hello everyone, welcome to the Mini Orange. Here we are going to set up SSO for the ASP.NET Web Forms app. This is the demo ASP.NET Web app that I will be using for SSO setup. Let's install the ASP.NET SAML module. Go to browser and search for ASP.NET SSO. You can get our solution from our site. Click on the download button to download Mini Orange ASP.NET SAML connector. Select the type for your application from the drop-down and download the solution for your application. If you are not sure about your application type, you can contact us at OAuthSupport at Securify.com. For the setting of the module, extract the ASP.NET SAML SSO module zip. Add MiniOrange SAML SSO.dll file in bin folder for your application. Register Mini Orange SAM LSSO module in your application according to the provided steps in the integration.md file. Add the provided configuration file SAML in the root directory for your application. After integration open browser and browse the connector dashboard with URL below. If it pop up the registration page or login page, you have successfully added the Mini Orange SAML SSO connector for your application. Now, register or login for configuring the connector. Now, we will configure an identity provider. For configuration, we will be use Mini Orange as an IDP. If you don't have an account with us, you can register with us at the below URL. If you have an account with us, then you can log in using the below link. After creating your account in Mini Orange, log in using username and password sent to your email on account registration. After login click on Apps tab. Click on Add Application button. Click on the Create App button to create new SAML app. Select Custom SAML App. For configuring your IDP you need to provide SP Entity ID and ACS URL values. You will get the values from the connector. You will find the service provider metadata on the right side of the screen you can have three option to provide metadata to your IDP. Here we are using the download metadata file option. Click on the download link to download SP metadata. After downloaded SP Metadata, go to your SAML app, and click on the Import SP Metadata button. Enter your app name here. Select File option for uploading your metadata file. Select Downloaded SP Metadata. Click on the Import button. Click Save to save your IDP details. The app is configured successfully. After configuring your identity provider, you need to provide IDP Entity ID and IDP Single Sign on URL. For IDP Entity ID and Single Sign on URL go to your IDP and click on Select and then Metadata Link. You will see the Show the Metadata Details button, click on the button. Click on the Download Metadata button to download IDP Metadata. After downloaded IDP Metadata go to your app and click on the Upload IDP Metadata button. Select Downloaded IDP Metadata. Click on Upload button. Click on Test Configuration button to test whether the connector is configured correctly or not.
On successful test configuration, you will get the user attributes. Now we will map IDP attributes with the application attributes. All the mapped attributes will be stored in the session so that you can access them in your application. To integrate the module with your application click on the integration code tab. Just copy-paste that code snippet wherever you want to access the user attributes. You can use the following URL as a link in your application from where you want to perform SSO. For example, I am using this link in my application like this. Let's see how it works. Go to your application and click on the link which you have added for SSO. Log in with your MiniOrange credentials. You have successfully logged in. This module is compatible with the below IDPs and all other SAML 2.0 compliant IDPs. For more information reach miniorange.com or you can contact us at oauthsupport at securify.com.